I'm a Keller Williams realtor and I represent athletes and entertainers looking to buy real estate and sell real estate all over the world. So how do you get started working with sports and entertainment clients? Know who they trust. Understand that those relationships with the advisors, it starts at a very humble level prior to the actual relocation. How do you get in front of these advisors? Go to events. Go to the charitable events that are going to have a lot of people. These are not just the target client. These are also people that, believe it or not, are going to help your business in other ways. So this is where the trusted advisors will be. Sports agents, talent agents, financial advisors, business managers, family members. The second place to meet potential sports entertainment clients, industry events. You have drafts, you have winter meetings in baseball, you have pro days at schools. All of these areas are focus areas where people are gonna be congregating and you're gonna be able to make some connection points. These are very informal spaces. You don't have to go in with a business pitch. You can go in as yourself, be your authentic self, offer some value that you can basically handle any type of real estate or housing need that's required. So the third touch point to get into the sports and entertainment client base, be proactive when you see new athletes and entertainers coming into your market. You are the expert in the housing. Lead with rentals. Lead with the private inventory that no other agents have. Be over-prepared and figure out on social media channels like LinkedIn and Instagram who's connected to these athletes and reach out to those people. We've built a massive network of sports and entertainment real estate agents within Keller Williams, and you have the opportunity to go network with those agents. That's going to yield business, not just in the S&E world, but also in just regular referrals for real estate transactions going between your two markets.